If you've been watching any television, then you've probably seen the Sonic from General Motors being thrown out of airplanes, jumped and all kinds of things. Well, Chevrolet Performance have taken it to a whole other level with the Chevrolet B-Spec Sonic behind me here. I'm with Jamie Meyer, mate. This is an exciting piece of kit you've got here in the booth. Yeah, it's a really cool car. You know, we're at the PRI show and there's a really wide variety of performance parts and performance vehicles here in the Chevrolet Performance display. They range from the outrageous V8 cars, the Copo Camaro, including this car, which is an SCCA B-Spec Sonic. Very small car, very popular right now on sale at Chevrolet dealerships. And what the racing team has done is taken this vehicle and optimized it per the B-Spec rules and turned it into a really competitive road race car. Who is this targeted at specifically? Yeah, for me, it looks like the entry-level road racer. There's a lot of guys that want to practice in, a, in a, a lower class, but it gets you into a very affordable car. Uh, you buy all of the suspension packages from Chevrolet. They've developed the entire portfolio of parts. Put it on your Sonic and take it out of the track and go have fun. Well, aside from being a beautiful shade of blue, there are a lot of other components in there, too, isn't it? Yeah, and I'm no expert on all the engineering that goes into this. It's just a great program. We'll get Jeff Kepman to answer some of those tech questions for you. Okay, Jeff, give us the nuts and bolts breakdown of the B-Spec Sonic. It seems like it's pretty exciting under there. It is. It's been a lot of fun developing this. And as Jamie said, it's for the SCCA B-Spec class. Um, there's multiple manufacturers involved, and so we're really excited to go up against them and show what we can do. The main thing that we've done that's allowed is the suspension mods. So we put in uh, solid suspension mounts, replaced the rubber, uh, developed coil over shocks, and with valving tuning exactly for this car for the road race. What about the brakes? I hear they've had a little bit of a touch up as well. Yeah, we really, the stock brakes work good. We put on uh, racing pads and then modify the ABS system to work with that. Right. And an upgraded ECU? Yes, um, we did tune the ECU for this class of racing, and there's some rules that we're not allowed to go beyond a certain RPM limit, so there's nothing trick in there, but it does allow the car to work best with the restrictor plate. As far as the powertrain's concerned, kind of limited in this class as well. Yes, it is, and again, the whole reason is to keep the cost down. As Jamie mentioned, you should be able to put the car together for about twenty-five dollars to $30,000, which is a pretty reasonable give, grassroots start. And inside, everything's been removed. Yes, so uh, we strip all the interior out. Now that's up to the racer to do. We, you know, they go buy a Sonic and get the safety equipment, the SCCA spec roll cage that they put in it and all the seats and steering wheel and so forth. Excellent, thanks very much, Jeff. If you'd like to find out anything else about the products we've talked about here today or any of the parts in the Chevrolet Performance catalog, you can download the catalog at chevroletperformance.com.